So uh, guys, welcome back to see our fishing Guernsey. Uh, going out for a little uh, bass session this afternoon. We're going somewhere I've actually fished before. We're not on the actual island. We're going to uh, Lee Island. It's um, on the west coast of Guernsey. So yeah, I've fished on the boat around here. I've never actually been on the island fishing, so I thought it'd be a change today to do that. And yeah, we'll be chopping and changing with the lures and that's what we can do. Got a bit of a breeze, but hopefully that doesn't uh, hinder us too much. So yeah, quite excited about this one to be honest. We've got an hour and like an hour and a half till low water. So yeah, we've got to be careful where we are on Lee Wiling to get us cut off as the tide starts to pour in. But yeah, we'll uh, just keep an eye on the tide. We've got big, big tide still, 9.4 tide. So yeah, hopefully we can find you a bass or two. So we haven't been out on the rods for, uh, for a while really. So yeah, I thought I'd give it a go today. Go into the video, hit the like button and uh, share the um, channel, put it out there so people uh, yeah, find out that the uh, videos are there. So yeah, see how fishing goes, eh? Let's get on to the fishing. So here we are guys, there's the house in Lee Island. And you can book that place out. Probably throughout the summer, mom, something is, I might be wrong. But look at this for ground for bass. Absolutely awesome. We've arrived at the mark now, guys. <clears throat> Had to have a trek to get out here, that's for bloody sure. <laughs> well, hopefully, it's worthwhile. I said we're on Lee Island. I've never fished here on the actual shore, I've been in here in the boat and I've bass. So, hopefully, we can uh, get a cockle. So, we'll be starting off with the um, Lorenzo Esposite surface layer. And then we're chop and change. We find a bit of deeper water. While we're fishing over here, is big um, sand uh, patches and kelp and rack and stuff like that, which the bass absolutely love. So hopefully, we can get you a few bass today, guys. So if you haven't dropped a like in, uh, on the video yet, if you do that, we really appreciate it. Let's get those fish. Let's get our first cast in, baby. <clears throat> There's a lot of area to fish here, guys. Big, big area. And so we're doing with this lure, just nice and slowly, giving the rod a twitch to make that lure really move. In theory, Mr. Basil comes in and absolutely munches you from behind. Okay, guys, fish on. First bass of the day. Oh, there's a bass. Yeah, it's a bass. I'll change the lure over, guys. On the surface lure, and straight away, bang. Second cast after chain, oh, he's diving down. Oh, <laughs> first Lee Island caught bass. Oh, he's got like a steam train. Oh, not a bad fish either, guys. <coughs> Try and get him up. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Diving into the cow. Yes, all right. Get a little bottom up there. Beautiful. Happy days, there he is. <laughs> Just gonna get him up, guys, and I'll get you a better show of her. So, there we are, guys. Beautiful little basil. Absolutely nailed that Savage Gear V2 um, lure. It's absolutely dynamite, this lure. Absolutely love it. Beautiful. It's gonna get him on it. You absolutely know, for a small fish like that. Oh, calm down, mate. For a small fish like that, he's absolutely munched that lure. Oh. There you are, that's the lair. Absolutely beautiful. Happy days. Well up here though. <clears throat> well, so we get down there guys without breaking my neck on the weed and we'll get a release of her. So guys, one last little show of the little beauty. 
give him a couple of seconds to revive. Hopefully, he goes back nicely. Off back down to the cow. There's the first one. Let's get some more. Beautiful. Not on the move. <laughs> Swung for our cancer bass fishing, guys. If you've had, I don't know, 15, 20 casts with nothing, no action, or any splashes beyond the lure or anything, it's time to move normally. The bass probably moved on. There's one tip I can give you there. Just keep moving and moving and moving. That's the whole uh, game in lure uh, fishing, really. So yeah, I'm gonna head over to the next mark. So we'll catch you when we're over there. So guys, we move right over now. Can you see over there in the background? Little lighthouse, that's the uh, Hamwa. Some absolutely insane fishing around there. But certainly dangerous as well. You know, boats that sunk around there. It's crazy. It's nearly low water now. About 20 minutes till low water. So uh, yeah, we're going here another hour or so, and then uh, we make on our way back. So we've got a bit of a trek back, probably a good half an hour walk back to the van. Well, like I said we had that one bus, so it's all been well worth coming out. Be nice to get another one, man. I well, put the uh, Savage Gear V2 back on as well, I think. It's a bit deeper the water here, so Do -do -do. Do -do -do.
That's pretty cool, guys. <coughs> the uh, Priory of Notre Dame de Lille. Wow, 12th century um, well, building. And that's what's left it there. Isn't it? That's pretty cool. Awesome. The guys are right around the other side of the island now. Just going to have a few chops this side before heading back uh, to the van. Just before I give it a go. Hopefully the window is going to be too much for a clock from here. So you head on. Well, it's really nice to have a go just on here. All the boot lace weeds, you never know. You might find the cars all pushing around. Well, so with that first uh, Leo Island bass, I see uh, stoked with that one, to be honest. When I first got here, there was a uh, I don't know it's bass or longer, it's chasing the lower and every sort of cast. So, yeah. Well, there we are. So, <coughs> one bass will be coming back here again, that's for sure, in the future. 100%. Oh, yeah. Just nice to get out on the shore again. So one truck I think with the uh, surface nose to see over the uh, beds of the Finn of Appen guys. I'll uh, let you know. If not, uh, I'll see you on the outro. So guys, there we are. Our first uh, Lee Island bass, which I'm pretty happy with. So we had a few more casts around beyond me here. But the uh, wind's head on and making trying to make the uh, video a bit awkward. But uh, yeah, the uh, Savage Gear V2 coming off her uh, trumps again. Fun lost that bass. I say, right at the start, when I had the Esposite lure on, there were, uh, there were fish following the lure in every single cast. Big balls behind the lure, and then changed over to the um, soft plastic and boom straight away. I said, I'll be definitely coming back over here again because I really enjoyed it. It's a hell of a hike, <laughs> but uh, yeah, all worth it when you catch the fish. So yeah, if you've enjoyed this one, guys, you can smash the like button, subscribe, because it's got a bit uh, quiet recently on the subscribers, but that's the way it goes sometimes. We're getting closer and closer to the 500, but <laughs> when we get there, it's just a fun of fishing anyway. So yeah, as ever, you like this one, share, like, and subscribe. Let's see our fish from Guernsey. We'll be out fishing or foraging very soon. See you next time, guys. <laughs>